phase one was the boat chutes that was to provide the safe passage for someone coming down the river. So basically we have two massive concrete pads that provide the chutes and then between those there's a stilling basin of quarter ton riprap. So that was the recreational aspect of it. We also did all of just the beautiful uh, grouted stonework, uh, terracing, the stairs, um, added another boat ramp. So that was phase one. Phase two was really more subsurface work. So these were safety enhancements. Not a lot of uh, glamour to them and not for recreational purposes, but truly in the event that you were to miss the boat chute, it increases the chance of survivability. So the weir is overall constructed in three levels. So you have the highest part, then you've got a middle level, and then you have the lowest level. At the lowest level, we actually cut out a portion of it, and then we created a new concrete boat chute to go through there. That's to dissipate the hydraulic energy of the drop that you have going over the low notch of the weir. Then the middle level, because there's still a lot of hydraulic force, we weren't able to just place rock. We actually had to put grouted stone in. And again, the intent of that is to dissipate the hydraulic energy to basically step it down so that you don't have this water, this tremendous amount of energy basically just spilling over the top. Of, think of it as like a, over a table. And so this last portion, then we tied in to Phase three, which is where we have, or the highest level of the weir, that's where we're able to just wet set or dump in quarter ton riprap, again, to dissipate that hydraulic energy. Got all three phases completed, substantially complete. Contractor is looking at a time in the next couple of weeks to remobilize, just knock out some punch list items. But for the most part, uh, substantially complete, which means that it's, it's fit for its intended purpose. River's back open and, uh, you know, as flows, and the temperature rises, I uh, hope to see him out on the river.